So as you can see, we have this website here that we're going to use for demonstration purposes. We're going to attempt to dynamically replace the number 216-931-1212 using Mongoose Metrics technology. In order to accomplish this, we need to go to the dashboard located at dashboard.mongoosemetrics.com. So just give me a moment, I'll pop that in. So here we are at Mongoose Metrics. In order to get into the dashboard, click the login link at the top right. And we're going to log in with the login credentials that were provided to you via email from the client services department. So here we are with happy customer at mongoosemetrics.com and we're going to put in the password. As you can see this brings us into our dashboard and we have two different types of accounts here. We have a session and a one-to-one -one, but today we're going to talk about session and edit campaign. And here's the campaign name which can be anything you want and a description of the campaign which can be anything you'd like as well. So you just type the description here if you need to for any other third parties or additional people that may be in here. And for the session product, our campaign code will always display prominently on the top left of the page. And we have several other options here that we will explore momentarily, um, but I want to walk you through the options here on the right. Uh, one of the most popular options that our customers take advantage of is the free call recording that we offer at no additional cost. We just simply click Enable, agree to this long disclosure, and then click the box to agree, and then Enable Call Recording. Another option that is very um, popular amongst our customers is the post call email notification option. All we need to do in order to enable that is to click configure. Type an email address here as to where we want the recipient to get the email after the call ends and a subject line for that email address which I'm about to type right now. Once you have the email address and the subject in place you just click enable and submit. Now we're almost done. As you can see that it has been enabled, ready to go. So as soon as calls uh, and conclude, we'll see that coming in. And the default destination number. This is where the pool of numbers that we assigned to the campaign must ring to. So we're going to put in the main number here at Mongoose Metrics for this example. And we can track three types of traffic, PPC organic or PPC plus organic. I'm going to select that and save. Next we're going to move to the setup instructions. In the setup instructions, once again, the campaign code appears prominently on the top left portion of the page. And the code for the setup instructions is located in step one. So I'm going to highlight all of this, right click and click copy. Now in a standard text editor similar like this one, like Notepad, you just right click and click paste. And what we need to do now is define what the default number is. That's the number that is already on the website currently. So once again that number is 216-931-1212. So I'm going to go back into the notepad and I'm going to type that without any dashes or spaces. No dashes or spaces in any implementation of our code. And I got that there. Now I'm just going to highlight all of this with the number in place, right click and press copy again. Now using a normal just web editor, in this particular case we're using Adobe Dreamweaver, I'm going to go all the way to the bottom and locate the closing body tag which is right here. Just above the closing body tag is the most preferable place to place our Mongoose Metrics code. So I'm going to put a cursor here, then I'm going to right click, and then I'm going to click paste. And there is the code right above the closing body tag. Beautiful. Now I'm just going to upload my changes to the site. One moment please. And then I'm going to go back to the Mongoose Metrics setup instructions and go all the way to the top to campaigns. Now we're almost ready to go, except we need to do one thing. We need to edit our replace settings. This tells the code on the Mongoose Metrics um, dashboard where to look to find the number to replace on the website. So we're going to type the number 216-931-1212 and make sure that it's replace specific numbers and submit. Now that we have that in place, let's go back to the setup instructions and see how can we test this code to make sure that the number of placements going to occur. So as you see here, we can just verify that the installation is working by just copying this snippet of code and replacing our URL. So I'm just going to copy all the way here to the question mark and then I'm going to right click and copy. Now back to the page. Now I'm just going to go up here into the URL. Remember we're replacing this number right here and I'm going to right click and paste the question mark all the way to the end and once we hit enter 
this number should change dynamically on the page. And what do you know it does. Now the number is 888-908-3381 and we can correlate the keyword site test to this click. Thank you for watching.